you hop in the library. Yeah. Um, it's probably some okay books, dude. It sucks. Probably. I mean, you could probably read about like history of digital currency stuff and the like, internet. That's the thing, uh, though. What? I was going to bring that up. There's not a lot of books about like blockchain or NFTs or any of that stuff. There's a couple, but there's not a lot. Cause it's I, I haven't looked it up. But I, I feel like if you look under the right stuff of like not the key search terms of like very current blockchain stuff and like Bitcoin stuff. But if you're looking for like history of people building Internet apps and like layers of things that led to this point of Bitcoin, I think you might find something interesting. I think there's might be a lot of uh, value in historical digital stuff that people are thinking about like 1999 there's a dude that pops up on youtube who's talking about making digital currencies because internet has been around since the gosh darn like 1960s dude yeah people building layers on layers and you you learn a lot more about the future it's you learn about the foundation of what got you to little satoshi i think the the guy who uh started coding most of bitcoin is actually part of that space chain firm just doing little nodes in space trying to get this uh little economy from satellites going a little popping who how finny huh oh uh, no no it's just a, a name guy who wrote a paper on proof of work in the 90s dude there's a the the was it with a chick i don't know if that's proof of state i think it's let me look it up because that was interesting um it was a chicken a dude i don't i'm not sure if it was proof of work though um but they were doing it for like uh some kind of security thing no it was for email yeah they didn't want to spam it was cynthia dork and moni noir came up with the name of it i'm not sure if there's any predecessors uh What is she? Dork and Noir in 1993 wanted people to not get spam. So I don't know if they made or just it says a concept was invented by. Uh, and then in 1999, Marcus Jacobson and Eric Jules coined the term. But I remember looking looking up little Miss Cynthia over here because this was like recent and she's still alive and like doing youtube stuff so i was like yo what's going on dude a little princeton a little cryptography dude like like learning like books about cryptography cryptography probably how you pronounce it <laughs> um is uh like probably things you could read in a book and not be overwhelmed by the exponential momentum of bitcoin and current day cryptocurrency stuff and learn a lot about the future still but i want to eat now <laughs> You gotta learn about the past, see what patterns arise.